NBA players that flirted with fans. During basketball games, a lot of male fans concentrate on the moves and scores of basketball players. However, certain females concentrate on the players more than the basketball game. They notice both the moves of the players and their physical appearance, how muscular they are and how handsome they look. Basketball players are certainly attractive, not only because they are very tall, but they are also handsome and well-built. A lot of female fans find them very attractive, and some have been caught on camera flirting with them. Other times it is the other way around. Let's play full court, baby! Your go-to channel for the most interesting basketball topics. Halle Berry and Kobe Bryant The late Kobe Bryant is the first on our list. Kobe Bryant occasionally drew a lot of attention from numerous basketball lovers all over the world. The late Los Angeles Lakers star and legend marked a whole generation with his extraordinary plays, his appetite to be better, and the positive mentality he showed in every match. The Black Mamba gained a lot of female fans during his 20-year era in the league, and even after Kobe Bryant retired from the game, he went on attracting people from different areas. Kobe was an excellent player. He was the main face of the league in the 2000s. Everyone knew from the beginning of Kobe's career that he was special. Kobe Bryant's personality was of confidence, passion, and undying self-belief. Even at the age of 18 years, Kobe Bryant believed in his ability so much that he wanted to be the face of the Los Angeles Lakers ever since he stepped into the NBA. Kobe Bryant's radiance on and off the basketball court was something no other basketball player had. Most people believed that Kobe Bryant had a distinct ego and was arrogant, but those attributes made him the player he was, similar to the way he delighted fans with his skill and game. Kobe Bryant also drew massive attention from women, and some of these ladies could not hide their emotions to see the five-time NBA champion on the basketball court. One of these moments was when Halle Berry was checking Kobe Bryant out during a game in 2005. Halle Berry was sitting courtside when Kobe Bryant discussed something with the referee. Berry didn't miss her opportunity and gave Kobe a big sexy look, demonstrating she was attracted to the player. Halle Berry kept staring at Kobe Bryant seductively. After the game, Halle Berry was interviewed by Jim Gray, who asked her a question about her favorite player. Halle Berry replied, I'm a big Laker fan, that's for sure. A big Laker fan. And who are your favorite players? Colby and Karam Butler. Halle, thanks for your time. We hope to see you more NBA games. I hope so. Surprise kiss from JaVale McGee. JaVale McGee, who played basketball in college for the Nevada Wolfpack and was selected 18th overall by the Washington Wizards in the 2008 NBA Draft, has made our list for a smooth surprise kiss mid-game. During a Friday night's game on November 21st, 2014 between the New Orleans Pelicans and the Denver Nuggets in the Colorado Capitol, Denver Nuggets center JaVale McGee had his share of flirting. On this occasion, JaVale McGee went for a loose ball and he accidentally ended up in the front row close to one very lucky female fan. He got a calm kiss out of the deal. His momentum resulted in stumbling into the empty seat between fans where he stopped and ensured they were cool just before rejoining the basketball game. After the game, he joked with the reporter saying that the woman was his boo and one happy old lady smiling from ear to ear. Shaquille O'Neal kissed a fan on the cheek. Shaq, also known as the Diesel, is known for many off-court skills like rapping, acting, being an entrepreneur, working as an analyst on TNT for 11 years running, and most importantly, known for helping many people. When Shaquille retired, basketball fans came to the unhappy realization that they were not only losing one of the biggest and greatest centers of all time, but that they would also miss one of the greatest personalities in NBA history. Shaq's personality has attracted several beautiful ladies around him. One time, a lady wearing a red ATL shirt was brought to tears when O'Neal accepted to take a selfie with her during TNT's NBA playoff media broadcast in Atlanta. He ended up kissing her on the cheek and the woman just couldn't believe how lucky she was. In the TNT studio, Shaq later said, Don't hate me because you ain't me. I'm, I'm just saying. Saying. Up here. Nothing but love from us at full court here, Shaq Daddy. Luka Doncic, fouling in love with you. Luka Doncic, a Slovenian ball player for the Dallas Mavericks, the most talented out there for sure, is one of the funniest guys in the league. He demonstrated his funny and flirty nature with a humorous back and forth moment with Ashley Moyer Gleesh. Ashley Moyer Gleesh is a beautiful, talented woman who became the fourth female in history to be a full-time NBA referee. 
Luka Doncic was once seen flirting with Ashley Moyer Gleesh as Paul George takes a free throw. In the second quarter of the game, Paul George drew a shooting foul from Willie Colley Stein. Luka Doncic took the time to talk to the sideline referee. There seemed to be some humorous moment between the two with Tyson Liu close by. Moyer Gleesh seemed to be saying, what foul? before a reply from Luka Doncic sent her glancing sideways. NBA fans on Twitter went all out in guessing what Luka Doncic could have said to cause this beautiful reaction. Some fans suggested he was saying, fouling in love with you. This generated hysterics all over the internet. Tristan Thompson, see ball, get ball. Tristan Thompson, a Canadian-American professional basketball player and last played for the Chicago Bulls, won the NBA Finals back in 2016 with the Cleveland Cavaliers, and he also enjoys winning ladies' hearts. He has a child with Khloe Kardashian and was caught cheating with her while she was pregnant with his child, True. His reputation has continued to follow him around as fans are known to heckle him at the free throwing line with simply the word Khloe. In the lineup to try and distract him and encourage him to miss a shot. He obviously enjoys the limelight and likes to use the limelight to win the hearts of the ladies. Once with a reporter, he was asked about the game and said something to the effect of, See ball, get ball, same approach. That's pretty simple, you know how I do it, Tina. The reporter seemed to get flustered and he left by trying to kiss her on the cheek. Dwight Howard, it's all about the D. Dwight Howard is an American professional basketball player who last played for the Los Angeles Lakers. He is an NBA champion, eight-time All-Star, and takes pride in being a three-time Defensive Player of the Year. However, in Atlanta, he may have gone a little far with a reporter after she asked a routine question, and he responded with a fairly routine answer about defense. But he kept referring to it as just D. And his teammate, Dennis Schroeder, began to laugh, as he was emphasizing D just a little too hard, and both Howard and Schroeder began to laugh more and more every time he talked about the D. Our D was good tonight, so we gotta make sure our D stay good. The reporter was professional and unfazed, and appeared indifferent to this, and brought it back to the studio in the usual fashion. We hope you enjoy the video topic today. Subscribe to our channel Full Court for more interesting basketball topics.